at YouTube, J Thomas 1310. Happy New Year to all. Make sure you have plenty of drinks, smoke a stogie, have a smooch, whatever it is that you do to bring in the New Year. I'll probably be having a, a pretty fucking quiet one. Since having kids, it's been pretty quiet the last few years. Plus just age getting onto you, you just seem to slow up a little bit more. It would be nice to go out and have a party, but you just get too tired for that shit these days. Just time just goes way too quick. Would be good if we could have had a couple more months in before Christmas and New Year's came about. But, you know, just this being that hectic. So hoping, a, you know, 2017 is a much, much easier year. Hope to be able to go out and ride a shitload more. And you know, one thing I didn't do much in the year is not be able to go out and have a shoot. And if you haven't seen any of my older videos, you know, I've put a few of my shooting videos up. It's nothing spectacular, just been stupid with a couple of, couple of my guns with mates and getting to have a look. It's, you know, missed not going out and doing that. So it's, you know, probably only went out for a few, few um, shoots of my Glock this year. And I've gone and fired off an air rifle a few times for, you know, at, at what is it, one of our clubs around here. You can go, it's indoor air rifle and you know, part of Australian gun licensing is that you have to you know, prove why you want a gun you know, just for self-defense isn't, isn't a reason here in Australia it's pretty stupid but um, you know, I've got to have it for sports and hunting practice as well as target shooting so I've got to do a minimum amount of attendances to, to warrant me owning the firearms and even keep my license you know, it's been pretty shit of a year to try and be able to get out there with all the health issues I've had so I'm going to be having an exemption from it this year but which is a lucky thing and if there's any you know, Australian or well, sort of New South Wales firearms owners anyway you know you can do that if you haven't been out and you've been unwell or if you're too busy with work you can get exemption for the year for not meeting the attendances you know last year for the air rifle I did actually take a trophy home for for the best grouping so you put five five rounds in and you got to have the you know the smallest and tightest hole there is so I got you know each slug's four and a half mil and I had a six mil six mil grouping hole so it was pretty good so I got the the trophy for that so I was pretty stoked to be able to win that but didn't have enough attendances to be able to do it this year and I had some bloody good scores too so they, they didn't count in the comp in the end but next year I hope I can get, you know, get another trophy and maybe a couple more and then, and then get the pistols out and do some, some good fun tactical courses with it that we have so guys if you're out there partying stay safe don't do anything too stupid especially don't drink and ride or drink and drive stay safe and if you're riding out there, keep the rubber side down. <laughs>